I don't want to come off as a hater, but am I the only one who thinks Taylor Swift is a little bit overhyped? What's up guys, welcome to Things I and some other human beings hate and today the first person on the list is Taylor Swift. Now I'm not saying I hate Taylor Swift, what I'm saying is I hate the fact that I'm not able to escape Taylor Swift. I go on TikTok, the first thing I see is if you're a Swifty, you should vote Trump. Like, uh, no one cares who you're voting for. Just cast your vote already. No one cares if you're a Swifty or if you're a Swifty. So, whatever you're call yourselves, okay? Now, here's an example. Number one, the daughter is not even up to the voting age. And uh, the second thing is, um, I hate the fact that they forced that dog to be a Swifty. Yeah, he doesn't want to be a Swifty. He doesn't even want to be on that TikTok, but like, they, they forced him. That's unacceptable. That's unacceptable to his civil rights. And yeah, it's unacceptable. Hey, TikTok, please do not ever recommend me these Swifty videos ever again. The next thing I hate is when people in the comments type, like if you agree. Like, in case you don't know this, YouTube does not pay you for likes in your comments just so you know now you know maybe before you were you know you were triggered in the brain you don't know what you're doing but like now i have i'm telling you youtube does not pay for likes in your comments so um next time i wish anytime you type that like maybe the next time you ever think of typing like if you agree on someone's video uh you know you just automatically appear in a different dimension because i don't think you deserve to be with us okay you don't deserve to be in this dimension just you know just leave okay do not ever type like if you agree on someone's video because that's an unacceptable behavior the next thing I hate is school. I know most of y'all can relate to this one. Like, why are we forced to spend the first 18 years of our life in a cage where we learn valuable nonsense? Like, I, I mean, I mean, I'm not saying it's nonsense to some of y'all, but like, for me, it's nonsense because most of the information I get from school will never 98.5% be used in our everyday life. Like, it's, it's literally it's stupid, okay? Okay, like, look at this video I took in my history class. Some of the Apaches are cool with you guys, but we're cool with you you guys. In addition to the Cowboys and Indians, Teddy Roosevelt calls up his old Ivy League buddies and he says, so if a principal or maybe the government is watching this video, I want you to comment, like type right now, like tell me how is that supposed to teach me how to make money in the future or maybe feed my family or maybe get a wife or get a job. How is watching few videos in the class or whatever she was talking about, how is that supposed to help me in my everyday life? How is that supposed to help me in future? How is that supposed to make me successful? How is that supposed to make me escape the matrix? Like these are the questions that you all should be asking yourself, but like, hey, um, I'm me and you are you and um, uh, yeah, um, I hate school. The next thing I hate is when people watch my video and they do not subscribe. Like, <coughs> anyways, I have life stuff to take care of in the next few minutes. I'm not saying I hate YouTube, but um, 